The South Plains Made of Cotton contest was held last evening at the Lubbock Municipal Auditorium. We want to visit this morning with the second alternate first with the South Plains Made of Cotton, Mary Sue Wilson. She is from Lubbock, and Mary Sue, uh, you're going to Tech, and what is your major? Well, I'm in the engineering school, and I'm taking commercial art. And uh, what do you plan on doing after you graduate? After I graduate, well, this is just one of my ambitions, but I'd like to go into the art field and have a horse ranch in Wyoming. A horse ranch? Yes, sir. That's sort of unique, isn't it? Yes, it is. I've been interested in horses all my life. And uh, what kind of horses? Quarter horses or uh, Tennessee walking horses, race horses? What kind of horses? Well, Arabians and... American saddle horses and Tennessee walking horses primarily. Oh, you uh, really a horse a horse fancier then? Yes, sir. And uh, in uh, the uh, engineering school, that's sort of unique too, being in that department, isn't it? Yes, sir. It is. There aren't many girls in that department. And of course, we know your father very well, Jimmy Wilson, over at the athletic department. How, how does your father feel about uh, you uh, being the second alternate? He is really thrilled. It, it, his birthday's day after tomorrow tomorrow in fact and he just thinks of this as a birthday present well you can save yourself a couple of pennies then can't you yes sir i can well we want to congratulate you and wish you the best of luck and how do you feel about maybe next year entering i think it would be a wonderful experience this year i've just had an education and next year maybe i can use it (laughs) and uh, have you ever been in any beauty contests before well yes sir I have. I, I was in a Demolay Sweetheart contest. and uh, None of them quite as big as this, though, or have they been? No, no, sir. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most wonderful thing that's ever happened to Well, me. we want to congratulate you again and wish you the very best of luck. Thank you very much. Mary Sue Wilson, who is the second alternate of the South Plains Made of Cotton contest here at the Lubbock Municipal Coliseum. Let's visit right now with the South Plains Made of Cotton for this year. And she is Nan Kelly, a young lady whom we visited with yesterday morning. And Nan, congratulations. Thank you, sir. How do you feel? Wonderful. Well, had you expected it to come out this way? No, sir, I surely didn't. (laughs) And uh, could you tell us uh, why you entered this Made of Cotton contest? How do you feel about (laughs) cotton? I'm proud to represent the South Plains area in the Made of Cotton contest because we produce over a million bales of cotton, which is a tenth of the nation's cotton production, a crop that is so important to our economic welfare here in this area. Nan, could you sort of give us an idea of some of the things you've had to do in the past couple of days in this Made of Cotton contest? How did you start off? When? Well, let's see. We began having meetings on Friday afternoon, and... uh, we were given instructions about modeling in our speeches and a hair consultant gave us some advice. Then on Monday, the uh, interviews began? Yes, sir, at 9 o'clock at the country club. And then you had an all-day session out there. How many uh, different wardrobes did you have to model for the judges? We just wore street dress and a bathing suit. When when uh, when they announced that you were the winner, how did you feel at the moment? Well, I didn't understand what he said. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. I was shocked to death. We want to wish you the very best of luck, Nan, and we know that you represent the South Plains in the grand style. Thank you. I'll try my best. Thanks a million to Nan Kelly, who is the winner of the South Plains Made of Cotton contest, for visiting with us this morning.